You have, uh, I, I mean, are we fighting this? Uh, oh no! Uh, we so we're not going to fight this. You are going to fight this. Jordy <laughs> is going to step in on this one, and what's going to happen is Jordy is going to take the position. Oh, Jordy, the one who tweeted me, is actually here. Yeah, yeah uh, 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 that, that's that's uh, Jody's alter ego, uh, oh, Jordy. Uh, I'm gonna go Jordy. full SJW, and I'm gonna take the position of this uh, guy, Jose. Okay, Joe gotcha. Jose Francisco Gomez. I'm gonna ride for him, and I'm gonna completely embody what this guy is saying. Yeah, that's what right. I'm gonna do. Throw in some of the pronoun the Kelsey debate too. That'd be good too. Absolutely. Hit me up. I'm Absolutely. A monster. I want to hear all about it. All right, I got this. Okay. So it's going to uh, be impossible to win this because I'm going to give jo Jordy the vote probably at the end anyway. But let's have some fun. Go let me go to my man Tupac's $5 donation. Shout out to Tupac for the $5. I appreciate you, Pac. Your graph is coming up soon. He says, what's good, Justice League and chat? I can't wait to see what this stream brings. I'm on season three of Avatar, and my favorite character is Azula, sexy and evil. That was 14 minutes ago. Shout out to my dude, Pac. His favorite character is Azula, sexy and evil. I can't knock you, Pac. She's tight. <laughs> She's tight. Shout out to Avatar, man. But now with that being said, let's go ahead and give you guys that first topic with these new beautiful graphics, new fonts, new everything is crisp and sharp. Shout out to Dust Kicker for being awesome. First topic up, YouTubers should not discuss pop culture topics during coronavirus. Andy, you are all. I am. I am succeeding. You to have Yang. You're going to be defending it. You're being yourself, actually. And uh, Jordy makes his cameo. All right. Am I starting? Go ahead. Look. Uh, Ten minutes this, on the clock. This is a. Uh, obviously, we're going through a pandemic, a global pandemic. But people are stuck at homes, man. They can get the news when they want to get the news. We got to entertain the people. All right, Jordy. So we got to entertain the people. We can't just have gloom and doom the whole our whole lives. You know, we, we can take things seriously and we can still have some side topics here. Talk about the Snyder Cut, which let's be honest, whether we like the Snyder Cut or not, it's a good distraction uh, while we're stuck at home trying to do what's right for the American people. You know what I'm saying? And a globe, because I don't want any old people dying. And if I go out, I might kill some old people. So I got to stay home. And uh, I'm going to do what I'm told. I gotta do it. And, and while, while I'm hold, I, home, I want to have some fun, some levity. And that's what this, these topics are. That's what these shows are. So I don't see the harm, Jordy. What, what's the harm? The problem is all of you people on YouTube with your status and your followers and subscribers, you have the ability to actually sway the minds and educate people of what's going on in society. To talk about Batman, Superman, Zack Snyder, who gives a shit about that? People are dying in the streets. There's a virus out there killing people, and you're sitting there with your power, your platform, to actually spread awareness and educate people. You have a responsibility, and you're not using it. It's people like you are the reasons why people are out there at playgrounds, playing basketball at the beach, football and shit. All out there in the streets, not listening to the social distancing laws, getting infected and infecting my grandparents and uh, this man, uh, Adam's grandparents. And who's this? Tupac's grandparents. It's irresponsible and you should be ashamed of yourself. Well, I mean, there's something called, uh, you know, the Constitution, Bill of Rights. We have rights, George. This is you unprecedented. Know? This is no, there's rights still that we have to follow. And look, uh, just be, what, what can I, who's to say I haven't done those? Uh, put my, put my, uh, you haven't, alert. you uh, haven't. I'm not sitting here in my studio. You I won't even say that. coronavirus on your channel. Uh, you won't yeah. even acknowledge it as coronavirus. You call it Bud Light. You're making a joke of it. People well, are no. dying. It's just a, uh, you know, it's that I, I would criticize YouTube for that because YouTube won't let us creators make a living. And when I'm out of a job, Jordy, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do to sit here and not make money? Who's going to pay? Who's going to feed my children, Jordy? Are you going to feed my children so I can say coronavirus and not then make any money to pay them to put food on the table? What are you going to do then, Jordy? Who's going to pay for those children? Uh, hello, that's why we have a government. You have to trust in the law, trust in the government. Well, the stimulus package, stimulus package, stimulus package is going to pay for people's unemployment, and we're going to get money. Three months while we're gone. What? How long? How far are you going to? Three weeks. Not three months. Three weeks. See, that's the problem. Jordy, to pay more of the billionaires. 
How is that stimulus package helping America, Jordy? Hey, excuse, where have you been in the news, Mr. Pop Culture? Don't you understand oh, that the, the great, you, the great and awesome, the legendary Bob Iger sacrificed his pay so that the employees beneath him can eat? Well, you need to read better because he only sacrificed his base salary, not his bonus structure. In fact, uh, the, what the one right under him, he makes about two four point five million a year. He's only taking half of that. Why aren't you mad at him? Doesn't Bob? matter. Doesn't matter. He's still giving it up. The point is, he's being responsible. What are you doing for this? What are you he's doing for Corona? Fifteen million dollar bonus. He's only cutting one million off of his two point five million base salary. That's enough. How much for are you story. cutting? Are dying, How Jordy. much are you cutting? Whoa, 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 How much whoa, 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 are you whoa, whoa, whoa. contributing? Wait a second. Wait a second. I'm going to call this out, Jordy. You're okay with the Disney Corporation who makes billions. I don't make billions, but you're going to focus on me when you should be really yelling at them. That guy is giving up a million of his seventeen million dollar package. That's enough for you when people are dying? I thought you were fighting for people who were dying, Jordy. I am fighting for people who are dying. What's wrong with you? A million dollars. Okay. A million dollars is better than nothing. What are you giving up? What are you giving up? You're giving nothing. You're talking about Zack Snyder, who is a legend, by the way, and who helped DC. But whatever, whatever. I didn't I'm not commenting. I didn't come at your Twitter and, and get at you because I'm a Snyder bot or anything like that. I'm legitimately mad that you're talking about stuff during coronavirus with people out here dying, not covering up, and you're just pretending. Pretending like coronavirus doesn't exist. How dare you? What is well, that? I'll say coronavirus. We, I think I hear it about a million times every day. It's impossible to not hear the coronavirus. You know, People need the sometimes, education. Sometimes, you know, you can over-educate somebody to a point where then they don't take it seriously, Jordy. And then when we don't take it seriously, we're going to get fed up in our houses and we're going to suck. And I'm going to get really fed up when I see someone like Bob Iger, who you just, you just gave him a round of applause as if that's not the thing he should Because he's helping do. the cause. He's helping you know, the cause. He's, he's enough, helping Jordan. the cause. You, know you are proving your true He's colors. helping the cause. You are proving your true colors. His, he's helping the cause by giving 5% of his salary. When yeah. The dude makes yeah. dollars a year. No. That's you think that's enough. How yeah. much more could that man save? A million dollars that we didn't have to put masks on faces of our medical professionals who are out there risking their lives in this war against the virus. That million dollars that you're trying to diminish, you terrible person, is going to put masks on faces and gloves on hands for our Let's medical professionals, masks. and they're doing God's work. Let's speak about masks, Jody, because, look, I'm not a rich man. I'm not making any donations on this stream. Uh, you know, I'm here just cause I'm supporting my buddy. Right. And the problem is I can't really, I, I can speak about it. I can do what I can do. I can distract the people, but you know, who could do something about it? Mr. Bob Iger. Now, Mr. He Bob did. Iger, he's he giving did. away, giving away a paltry percent, that whole, all of those executives over at Disney. That is not enough. They are letting people die. They could be making even more masks and you're okay with that. Jordy, you're okay with that man with that. What's his, the second Bob Chepek. You're okay with Bob Chepik profiting right now, seventeen million dollars in the term of in the time of an endemic. When what is he even doing? How is Disney even making money? How many masks could they make with seven? Let's let's be let's be nice and give him two million to live off of this year without doing a thing, right? Let's give him two million to live off of. That's fifteen million dollars. You're not fighting for that. You think they're doing enough, Jordy? Is that a trick question or something? Didn't I yeah. just tell you that he, they're giving up salaries? They're giving up salaries. Sure, they're rich. They could give more. But beggars can't be choosers. Have you heard that phrase? Yeah, they're well, giving they're up millions of dollars for us. Yeah, for yeah. us. For yeah. our benefit. For strangers' benefit. To have coverage and protection to protect lives. And you're trying to deflect. That's your problem. You're getting on people who are up there donating when you need to be playing Robin Hood and be giving some money up or give it at least if you want to be so cheap. You're from Florida, so you're cheap. And you could go ahead and make videos that educate the people. Jordy, you know, let's let's get real, right? Because we're arguing about getting distraction with Disney. All this. You know this isn't really that big of a deal, right? See, you're a dark, sinister you know, you know, person. People yeah, are just, dying, and this is not a big deal. How you, right? dare you? You, know, more you people are die a terrible person. More people die in car accidents. Like, if are we going to stop driving? Oh, very. That's a real easy way to try to simplify the deaths that are happening to our old. Yeah, I think Italy would have a problem with what you're saying right yeah, now. They're just a lot of people in Italy are doing okay. I mean, some might say we're overreacting, Jordy. I mean, President Trump has said. You know, let's get people back in mass in Easter. I mean, the Lord needs us to be there. How are we not? I mean, what's more important than speaking to the Lord and being there for God? 
Well, that's and something. Okay, Dean, okay. I could agree with that. Now you're starting to make some sense to me. Now, right, finally, so we, you're using your brain. You're using right, your so brain. Therefore, you're admitting that we should leave this quarantine, go to mass in, in, in a bunch of us, go to church together. And if we spread it, we spread it. Because you know what? No, I, more- I, I didn't say that. There's virtual uh, sermons and all, all kind of stuff going on. But the point is that and, and, oh, and you yourself so are a virtual face. Like you're you on the know, screen the right now. World. You're virtual, virtual right now. It's not the room of the, the you know, the, the room of God. You know that, right? I mean, my as much as he's everywhere, there's one place of worship. Am I right? No, there's a, there's a lot of people that 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 have different beliefs. So and you're, and my, uh, the the, the, the me I can't I can't I mean, you're going against the, the goal. Uh, right? The, the goal of it all is that it's going to positivity. All of them are trying to be positive, and that's the problem with you. I see you and some fat bearded guy yelling and yapping and complaining about Zack Snyder when he lost his daughter, and you guys talking about Justice League and all this stuff that doesn't matter when people are dying in the streets. You still don't see it. What if it hits you at home, hits your grandmother, your grandfather, your siblings? How would you feel? I bet you wouldn't be laughing then. Well, I don't I don't think anyone was laughing. I, I think you're talking about not making a video about the Snyder cut. You guys were laughing on that Snyder video, making fun of him. Making fun of Snyder, who has nothing to do with what's going on with Corona. Well, I mean, you could argue that Snyder shouldn't be doing commentary screenings either. Is that what you're saying? Is it his fault? Who's He's fault? Giving up news. Who's fault? Zach Snyder's out there doing commentary, uh, you know, making a stream about BVS, which I, I you know what? I he, think he's doing it within the safety of his own home. That's his choice. The BVS. That's his choice. I would argue that the coronavirus is more important than rewatching Batman v Superman. Nothing's more important than watching Batman v Super. Um, I mean, I, you're yeah. I can cave there, but oh yeah, we, we, I was hoping we found some agreement there. Wait, what was that? You you would say Batman v Superman is be- is more important than the coronavirus? Okay. Well, anyway, I, I, you might be stuck against a the wall there, so I don't want to. I don't want to press too hard. But all I'm saying is, you know, I, I think it's really Zack Snyder to blame, not me. Right? Time, I mean, time, dude, just, time. All right, let's go right into the flash rounds. I'm going to go first. Okay, yes, please. I want to make sure you're heard. This person, ladies and gentlemen, you hear it. That's why I had to come here and defend all the people out there who are suffering and dying. YouTube channels have an obligation to the public to use their power, like this ring light and this camera, to use their power and their influence to not only... uh, educate people but to also spread awareness for what's going on and bring in levity and seriousness to the situation at hand andy is guilty of one major thing downplaying the severity of coronavirus my grandpa is ill it's not it's not a joke Zack snyder can do what he wants he made one of the greatest movies to ever hit this planet and he deserves to be left. Leave him alone. Zack Snyder is the best thing that ever happened to the human race. I swear the Justice League cut. Release the Snyder cut. Release it. The Zack Snyder cut is the best thing that ever happened to pop culture since pop culture was created. Andy. Well, I mean, how do I follow that up? Uh, I guess I would just say that... Uh, uh, I mean, you got me there a little bit. I got to, I'm reevaluating. All right. Um, well, let's see. Uh, look, coronavirus is fake. Uh, the Lord is more important. Fake news. Uh, worst I want to get out of my house. My family's making me go crazy. I think we all just rather all get back to work, pay our bills. Uh, you know, I want to see some movies again. Uh, you know, uh, yeah, the old people, uh, if they have to die, they have to die. Uh, I mean, it is what it is that more people die in, uh, in car accidents than, uh, you know, the, the, the flu. So what are we doing? You know, it's not that big of a deal. So that's right. My main argument there is, uh, as for BVS, I mean, yeah, uh, I, no, it's not the best film ever made. Uh, but coronavirus, look, I we, we don't need to, CNN's got plenty of coverage. I, I'd rather talk about Zack Snyder right now. Get some distractions. Give the people what they want, Jody. Jordy. So that's where I'm going to say there as I try to fill up more time because I don't know how to One react to a joke. Time. Time. <laughs> All right. Uh, so that was uh, that was Jordy. 
and George, uh, of George SJW. And uh, that was topic number one. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, um, this is going to be a separated video. Thank you, everyone who was here for the live stream. Uh, they'll have the full effect of what's going on here. But uh, as you guys know, put down in the comment section of this particular video of who you think won based on the argument. If you agree with Jordy because of his argument, if, if you if you if you disagree with Jordy, but his argument was better than Andy's, you need to be voting for Jordy. Or if you just thought it was funny. I mean, or, you know, or better, you know, whatever. And, or, or Andy's, you know, who had some logic in there, who muddled it up a little bit with some false sense of uh, everything will be okay. <laughs> uh, vote for Andy. Uh, we're voting based on arguments only and not whether you agree with the topic or not. That's what this whole entire show is about. So, uh, yeah, that's a... Uh, uh, thank you, you freaking douchebag, for coming and, you know, freak him. Next topic is Ooh. who wins, the Avengers or the Justice League? All right, now, hold on, hold on. What, what versions? Uh, What versions? Are you talking about cinematic versus comic? Yeah, what are we, how are we quantifying this? Which one are you more comfortable with? Better. 